Oh, it's a hot day today. Welcome to another video. Today I'll be eating um, at this place called Jin All You Can Eat Sushi. So as, it's, as the name suggests, it's, an, it's a buffet style kind of sushi restaurant. Like from what I've read on Yelp, it's, they set a two hour limit for how much sushi you can eat within the two hour limit. And yeah, I've been eating since this morning. It's right now, it's about, it's about 12.30. And yeah, I'm waiting for a friend to come and head in and get some food. So this is the menu here. We ordered this, the sushi lover one. So the second one um, includes this, this. And the top section of this, so it's single piece sushi. So, yeah, unfortunately, out of sea action today, which is kind of bummer. Yeah, we ordered some rolls and see how it goes. So, I'm gonna try the soft shell crab roll here. So, here it is. Okay, give it in some. I don't really taste a lot of soft shell crab, but I, it's good. Sauce is kind of thick and sweet. Yeah, it's not too bad. Oh, it's breaking up. This is the tamago. This tamago here is actually slightly thinner than what I'm used to. This is much thicker, but it's not bad. This is the ASU roll. So there's some jalapenos in the top and looks like tuna and shrimp tempura inside. So this is the seared salmon. So slightly seared. There is some sort of I think so it's garlic on top. Let's try it out. Not too bad. Kind of overpowering the garlic. Pretty decent. Mouth flavor. This is the eel. So they have the sauce on top and some sushi rice on the bottom. Pretty good. Nice teriyaki sauce. Good amount of sweetness. So this is the tuna chip. Looks like some nachos, some ground up tuna, some just some teriyaki sauce and some chives and onions, tomatoes. This is the tuna chip. This chip here has some, some sort of seasoning. So it's like kind of savory. It tastes more of the tuna by itself. And it's more like a spicy tuna. It has a nice kick onto it. Pretty nice. This is part of the uh, appetizer menu here. It's also included in the all you can eat menu. The tempura here. They have a salmon and snow crab. Dipping sauce here. Ooh, it's hot. You can see the steam. Here is the chicken karage. Try. Nice and thin batter. Very similar to the tempura. Tastes good. The sauce on it is not too bad. I like it. So this is the salmon skin roll. Inside we have here some cucumbers, the salmon skin itself, and also looks like a carrot. Give it a try. I'll put a dip on some soy sauce. So this red piece here is kind of like a pickled carrot, I feel. It's kind of a bitey. And the salmon skin itself, it's a bit more chewy. So, but when you bite into it, it uh, gives a nice crunch. It's not too bad. So apparently, this red piece here, it's not a carrot. It's something called Yamagobo. So this is it. In Google, it says, Yamagobo is a Japanese pickled point out root. The prepared root looks long, thin carrots. So it does look like carrots. And the color is obtained by processing the root with orange coloring. I've had a lot of Japanese food over the years and I never came across this. So this is new for me. So this is the snow crab roll. So there's some nori here and some sushi rice on the bottom. Let's try it out. So that roll was not too good. I felt that the it's too much rice. Yeah, have a bit of sauce. Yeah. Salmon nigiri. So basically thin sliced salmon with some rice. 
some soy sauce on it. So this here is the tempura style tofu here. Give us an impression of the taste. Oh, it's hot. I can't stop with my mouth full. It's not bad. So we have some spicy crab mix, cucumbers, and some chopped jalapenos in the pot here. And it looks like a similar sauce to the chicken curry stuff. Good try. Let me try the yellow tail here. Tastes not bad. Nice sweetness on in the yellow tail. The seared tuna here, nice red. Oh, real quick, very juicy. Here is the tuna. Here is the scallop. Nice and filled up. I didn't feel a lot of the, the scallop taste. That was okay. Kind of watery. I did notice that the nori around this nigiri isn't very crunchy. Kind of feel wilted down. No, maybe it's been out too long, but yeah. It's not as crispy as I would like it to be. Here is the salmon roll. I'm gonna try. Here's the shrimp. They said they're kind of big chunk of rice, as you can see. Here is the tonkatsu. Here is the octopus. It's not bad, it's not chewy. Here's a crab meat. Crab steak. Oh, crab steak. Oh, I can just drop down. So, we're done eating here. Overall, we ate about 24 items. So, that wasn't too bad. I feel that um, worth the value. Would I eat it again? Maybe if I'm feeling like a lot of sushi. Some of the items were good. Like the, the one with the shrimp tempura were obviously good ones. And then some of the, some of the seafood options weren't too good. But overall, great value. Um, yeah, this is how the restaurant looks like outside. Yeah. Till the next video. Uh, uh, yeah. Hope you